Hey guys, how are y'all doing today? I have a new book review for you and that is on The Shining by Stephen King. I was very excited to read Stephen King and it did not disappoint at all so let's get started with this review. Let's talk about the plot, what The Shining is all about. Our main characters are Jack Torrance, Wendy Torrance, and Danny Torrance and they are a family unit. Jack is looking to get a job as the winter caretaker at the Overlook Hotel. He gets the job. He and his wife Wendy and his son Danny, they move into the Overlook. They're to stay there during the winter months to take care of the hotel. Through events and circumstances you find out the hotel has a life force of its own. There are some creepy, scary things going on behind certain doors. These supernatural occurrences start to affect the family, more so on Jack's character and he starts to go a little, a little crazy. Danny, who is a very special kid, he has The Shining. He has the ability to see into the future, see into the past, see dead people. Danny's character is very central to the whole plot. Basically, that's the synopsis of The Shining. The Torrances move into the Overlook Hotel and weird, scary things are occurring, affecting the mental stability of characters. The potential of bad, bad, very bad things are about to occur. The Shining. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about the characters in The Shining. The characters were really full, had a lot of backstory, a lot of character development throughout the book. Jack Torrance is a great character. He's a recovering alcoholic. In his past, we find out he turns to the bottle a lot. And in the story, we find out what led him to become the caretaker at the Overlook Hotel, what happened in his past. We find out how the alcoholism, how his temper, issues with his father kind of contribute to how he is as a character. So Jack's character was really really great. His development throughout the story was really great. Falling into the spiral of madness is really interesting to read. Find a lot about Wendy's character. She's carrying baggage as well in regards to her mother. So her relationship with her mother kind of is reflecting in how she views her relationship with her son and the father. And Danny's character Oh, Danny. Danny. <laughs> he has the shining, the special ability. He can see things into the future. He can see things in the past and he sees bad, very horrifying things. He's only five years old, which is amazing. He does not come off as five years old in the book. He acts much older. He's a very strong character throughout the book as well. His development throughout the book was really good. I thought the characters in the book were really great, really well-rounded. I thought the love for Danny between Jack and Wendy was really strong. They come off as a great family unit, you know, until despite the baggage, despite past mistakes, they are putting a lot of effort into making it work. And I thought that was very admirable and I thought that was a really good aspect to these characters. Just want to become a happy family. Until the very end, I thought it was great. There was still that love kind of reflected at the beginning of the book, so the characters were really well done. So let's talk about the plot of The Shining. I thought it was really good. What I was really surprised about The Shining is it wasn't terribly frightening. There were a lot of creepy, disturbing scenes in the book, but it wasn't horrifyingly frightening, which I was surprised. I thought it would be more scary. The pacing of the plot was really well done. It was really great foreshadowing in the book. And we see how the family interacts together and how their relationship is at the beginning and how it starts to change as the paranormal and the madness overtake the family. A lot of great buildup of suspense and anticipation. It's all about the suspense, I think. It's a really great gradual buildup to the climax. Let's talk about the writing in the book. I really enjoyed Stephen King's writing style. I thought his writing style was easy to read. I really like the narration style in third person perspective uh, how Stephen King kind of narrates their thoughts and what they're thinking I thought was really good that being said guys I'm going to give Stephen King's The Shining a readable rating I really enjoyed this book I thought it was gonna be more intense and scary you know I was surprised I don't think it was like much horror as it was a contemporary fiction with a horror twist to it. There's a lot of focus on the family and the relationships these characters have with one another and there were moments of normalcy, happiness these characters were having together before the crazy. I thought that was surprisingly sweet. Really fun moments in the book and really funny moments. The potential this family had at being whole again. I thought the ending was amazing. It was awesome, epic. So I thought that was really good. I hope you enjoyed this review. I will have my movie review of Stanley Kubrick's take on The Shining. So we'll see how that went down and what I thought of it. So I will talk to you guys later and have a good night.